secondary or, or, or third or fourth character and, and is usually dragging over Kazumi. Yeah, super solid characters. So let's see, Kokoma versus Chanel. Guys, make some noise. This is going to be a really, really good match. And we are, again, in Russia. We can't get away from this place. Round one. It's the Arctic, man. We got no walls here, man. Anyway, it's going to go right into the action. Rock's dragging Chanel with Elisa. Kokoma using that dragon off. Yes. And this is a true test because, you know, obviously both of these players know how to fight against Dragunov. So yeah. that's going to be having, you know, it, it has to be in Chanel's mind. And Chanel's really going to pick a certain certain amount of t uh, moves from his arsenal to really deal with this threat. Yeah, so the thing about Dragunov is that, yeah, he's very simple. There aren't many moves that you're going to see him do. You, yeah. know, you see the down two, running two, down forward one. Very simple. But it's about how you utilize that moveset, how you mix it up with the timing. You know, I think really the, the hallmark of a great Dragunov player is how they use the down two and how they're able to change up the timing. Because more often than not, if you just throw it out there, you know, there's certain patterns, especially after it hits, yeah. you got to make sure that you're able to mix it up enough so you can create opportunities for the other moves that Dragunov has. I'll just say that. And Lisa with a counter hit, 10 seconds left on the clock, and he can just turn it now. Oh my what? gosh, I can't believe he hit him with that. What is that? I've never seen that move before. Very interesting stuff. Man, Chanel able to get on the scoreboard here. First round. Oh, jumping in the air. That was definitely not intended. Yeah, still able to get the combo there after the float. Interestingly enough, Elise is not going to get a massive punish on down two. Well, that's the thing now. If you look at Kokomo, he's starting to use the jab more in conjunction with the rest of the moves. Wow, he was able to step in in time. Yeah, but couldn't get a punish though. Down three from Elisa. How to hit slide. I think, you know, when Elisa used that standing four earlier, it kind of made Koko would play a bit more compact. He did not want to get caught with the counter hit again. Yes. Okay, so they even up the set. Here we go. But maybe this is the way that Chanel wants to play. Maybe this is the way he finds the advantage in the matchup. Down two. Oh, okay. interesting. He blocked. I can't believe he blocked because that was a guaranteed at least wall standing punish. Yeah. You gotta block that low. That is one of Elise's best lows, if not her best yeah, low. Yeah, especially on hit. It is such a, such a move. It's, it's similar to Dragunov's uh, down two on hit. You yeah. can really create a lot of offensive flow. Okay, back one. Yeah, and that, that's the that's a great mix-up too. Is using the the, the noggin. It, it looks really slow, but the active window frames when it comes out, it's so quick. Yes. Okay, running two plus. Oh, frames. he had the right read, but not able to land the hit. Okay, catches impressive, but with the one plus two throw, should get a guaranteed. Ta okay, gets it down two instead. Bit Opted more damage. for a little bit more damage, knowing that he was probably going to roll out of the way. Yeah. Mix up goes for the nothing into the throw. Oh, good break. Ten seconds left on the clock now. Trying to go for the mid to finish it. Chanel not ducking. No time left. Five seconds. He's gonna have to do something. Oh, oh. up forward three. I like it. Tried to go round for the Schweppes. Didn't quite work. Kokoma, one round away. Yeah, Kokoma trying to pull away here. You know he's looking actually really good in the matchup so far. Chanel's gonna have to work to create more opportunities for her character or his character. Yeah, one well, particular broken here. Okay, good. Using the homing move quite a bit, but Chanel gets kind of hit. Nice going the other way here. What's he gonna go for? Goes for the Oki. Oki Doki goes for the slide. Oh man, what is he doing? Is he ducking? He's ducking either that or he's trying to mini sidestep and he's just clipping him. Yeah. Because one of the things with the up forward, you can sidestep it if you sidestep early enough. Yes. Okay. One more hit. He's going to do it in the wild signing for such a safe option. Kokoma looking good. Yeah, and I like how he changed up the rhythm with a lot of his moves. Kokoma pulling away to the lead here now. He's up 1 0. And man, is he going to switch characters? That's what I want to see. Kokoma? He's thinking. He's thinking. Kokoma looked pretty comfortable there. Yeah, look at him. He's slapping it. He's like, you know, just another day in the office. I'm, I'm not afraid of this. Got to pull down the mask as well, mate. Get serious. Okay, we're going to stage luck. He's stuck. No. He is now stuck with Elisa for the duration. I feel like of the this whole set. day we've just been in Souk and Arctic Snow. Like, yeah. That's it. Just those two stages. Here we go, guys. Potential match point here for Kokomo. Crazy to see two strong players like this in the loser's bracket. Oh, yeah, man. And I, like I said, I'm waiting for the winner's final. I can't wait to see that. And it's going to be even crazy because one of those players is going to go to the loser's bracket. <laughs> Kudans versus the is going to be crazy. Yeah. Right now, Kokomo up 1 0. And Chanel locked in with Elisa now. Yep. Gonna have to bet his uh, tournament life here on his Round main one. character, which is never a bad thing, I guess. No, it's cool. Go out, fight. Oh, oh going the other way. Haven't seen that land in a while. Tried it again. Nice okay. down forward four. Trying to keep him modest, but this time getting sidestepped right away. Don't do it again. Yeah. Don't double up on me. Nice. While standing one pursuit, able to get the extra damage at the wall. They're yes. about even on life, though. Okay, with the jabs. Trying to keep him at the wall, but at least a nice sidestep. Goes for the homing move. Down two. 
chops, chops again. Oh yeah, now we're starting to see the down twos from Kokomo. He kind of didn't really use it there in the opening matchup, but this yeah. time using the Razor. Like you said, a good mark of a good uh, Dragon Pest. How you use down two, Rage Drive, slide. Oh, into the slidey back at him. Damn, Kokoa. Looking yeah, it really sounds solid. like he's taking your coaching style. He's like, slide, okay, I'll do it. No problem, coach, I got the spec. Bam, bam. Did she go to the wall? Oh, no, didn't quite. get it. Probably went for the one-two down one plus two. Not able to get it in time. Slid down from the wall, but now going the other way, Kokoma. Yeah. Oh, Whoa, counter hit or clean. Sick. Running to madness. Like, everything's hitting right now. It's all working. Oh, gosh, it gets the follow of their instant while standing four. Great stuff there. And one round away from eliminating Chanel. This is crazy. Kokoma looks so comfortable right now. Yeah. You know, when he didn't look comfortable is when he picked Geese. So I'm glad he went back to his senses. <laughs> yeah. All right, here we go. Goes for it. Try to get the launch, but man, the hesitation gets the grab. Yeah, the command two throw. And Chanel. that's the great thing about Dragonov we were talking about earlier. He has a throw for every situation. Yeah, not many characters have that. Going for the jab pressure right now. Down two, chops. Chanel, last opportunity here. Oh, nice duck there. Not able to get the follow up here. Goes for the risky stuff. Oh, oh. my god. Here we go. Another opportunity. Okay, chainsaws. More chainsaws. Oh, he tried to grab out of it. Not able to get anything, just out of range. But Chanel, oh, that might be it. Yes, and that is it. Kokoma taking it. It's super, super impressive. Three rounds straight there in the second match. And Chanel eliminated.